Hey folks, my name is Travis S1. Welcome back to Paper Mario the Origami King. In today's episode, we are now moving into Toad Town and we will also be going through the graffiti underground in this episode. Take care of two birds with one stone. From what I understand, these two are... I put these two together because they're probably short enough to be together. So that was kind of the idea when I was putting together the playlist of the series. Yeah, if you guys have been enjoying the series, please leave a like on the video. It helps out tremendously. And subscribe to the channel and comment so you don't miss out on any future content. Let's go ahead and just jump in. We're going to start with, uh, right here, fresh paper alert. Let's fold him up. And we've got ourselves a wave battle right to start the episode. Look, Mario, more, more puny little Goombas. This'll be a piece of cake. Line them up and take them out with a quick jump attack. Wait, something's wrong. No matter which ring you turn, that that one Goomba won't fall in line. I'm getting dizzy. Let's stop rotating the, those rings and think about this. If there's some other way to move enemies around. It's slipping. No, wait. Slowing, striding, line dancing? Oh, I remember, it's sliding. You can rotate each of the rings. You can also slide the panels into a, in a row. First, press L and R to switch from, from rotating to sliding. There you go. Your area of control has now changed from a ring to a row. Now we're ready to slide. Use the L to select which row you want to slide, then press A to confirm. Okay, it's time to slide. Let's get these Goombas lined up. Use L to slide the panels up and down. When you're done, press A to confirm and lock them in place. There we go. Now they're all lined up. And we're gonna go ahead and use the boots here, of course. Easy. Last wave. And we'll do the... And then we'll do the, uh, mechanic again. Pretty easy. And I kind of autopiloted hitting A there by accident, but yeah. Admittedly, this has had a longer bit of introduction than most games for like ex for explaining all this stuff. We're saved, what were those Goombas doing kidnapping us and where were they taking us? Were they even Goombas? They were folded in a really off-putting way. We're taking an L on this one, guys. We got rescued by Mario, but you know what? Maybe we should put aside our differences for a while, eh? We're all paper. Let's watch each other's backs. All right, guys. Let's fight folds with stacks. Move it out. Looks like my brother really is turning all kinds of paper folks into an army of folded soldiers. At this rate, it feels like the whole world is going to be overrun with them. Go ahead and collect a whole bunch of this. Always can't go wrong with having extra confetti. Might be necessary. Go ahead and use the confetti to fill this hole. We can see in the distance there's big Goombas there. And Music is a little ominous. Go ahead and fill this up here. Looks like we gotta have one more thing in confetti. Nice. Get ourselves a bunch of coins. Oh, well, 
salt, we probably still need some of this, right? I, pre I presume that um, something's probably about to happen, right? As we make our way into Toad Town. Her, it doesn't look like there's anyone here. Oh, look at that big hollow spot over there. That means my brother might have been here already, and I'm sure he was up to no good. Hold on, there is someone here. Are my eyes playing tricks on me, or is that creature way, way too big to be real? It's not like any origami I've seen before. And what exactly is it doing to that house? It's eating it. Ew, it's eating the house. I can't imagine how yucky it must taste. These macho, papery things must have been the source of the, of the holes we've been seeing everywhere. Ugh. Wait, look at that thing's back. To seal my brother's face. That might mean my brother is powering it somehow. That's the case, that seal could be some kind of weak point. Maybe if you hit the seal, it will get weaker somehow. And then you could take it down. Good shot, it's working. Watch out. Hit it again. Boom. Yes, that did the trick. So the weak point on that paper macho soldier was my brother's seal. You should remember that. Now what were we doing here? I'm all turned around after that excitement. Oh right, we were looking for the place where Peach's castle used to be. Well, the gate right is right over there. We might as well check it out. Keep that hammer ready in case we run into mo some more of those huge monsters, okay? And of course we'll grab the confetti that was released from that too. I'll kind of leave this place as is right now. I'm not too worried about it. We're not 100% in the game. What? The bridge is broken. Now how are we going to get to Peach's Castle? It's not like we could just jump in an underground tube, travel through it somehow, and pop out on the other side, can we? Uh, based off of that pipe, yes we can. Right here, I presume. Huh, not that one though. Interesting. We'll tear this one off. That's an orange pipe, that's really interesting. Grab these. Yeah, this is really ominous for a place called Toad Town. Bam. Boom confetti. So there was an orange pipe. Is it over here? Yes. The other end of the pipe is blocked. Well, that's interesting. So if we find another orange pipe, I guess we should probably try to tear it off, right? Might be a hint for what we need to do.
Nice. Good hit. Good. Okay, that looks broken too. Anything the sign says? Tram to Overlook Mountain. Well, I don't. Oh, what, what is this? Tram hasn't arrived. Snacks are running low. Morale even lower. Send help and snacks. Huh. That's kind of creepy. I will say this game has given a very ominous vibe so far, which is quite interesting. Not fully sure how I quite feel about that yet. We will fix this hole right here. This portrait of Toad is kind of creepy. I'm not gonna lie, like, it's just way too realistic for, like, a paper game. I couldn't make that jump. Okay. Yeah, I don't... I don't think we're meant to make that jump. Okay. Kind of cool that we could come in here, though. Don't think that helps us much. That was a long loading screen. I saw a pipe. We've already been down that pipe, so I can't, like, um... Can't go and check it again. Because it's not going to change destinations, I'm pretty sure of it at least. Okay, nothing in there. Sign. Weapon and item shop. Anything in here? One world, one pipe. A functional art installation celebrating large-scale plumbing. Whoa, there are so many cool pipes, but bet you've never seen anything like this before. Warp pipe. Warp pipe. This is also a warp pipe. Interesting. Everything's got question marks on them. Okay, well, let's see what's in number one, I guess. We'll start with one. Yes. The other end of this pipe is blocked. Okay. Am I in anywhere that's going to get me somewhere? I'm guessing you, like, this has to be something, right? Considering that I'm getting this, like, option here. I know I saw a green pipe on the other side, so maybe? Nope. Okay, so what exactly is this room for? at this point in time.
I feel like that's the right way to go. Ancient vessel of the legendary Captain Tealweed. Are we not in the right place? It certainly doesn't feel like we're in the right place right now, so this is just a basically a waste of time. Cool. Good to know, good to know. So like Battle lab, train totes. Basically tirelessly is what that said. Take the coin, I see there's a Goomba over there. We haven't been over here yet. Oh, there's a Shy Guy. We're trying to get to that shy guy. Okay. We can't get over there. The shy guys being over here and, and stuck is um, surprising. Hey, thanks for that. I owe you one. Oh, but I can pay you back right now with information. If you're trying to get to Peach's castle, you can take the suit. The sewer? Wait. Oh, I forgot to mention that you need a special manhole hook to get down there. I think my friend is using it right now. Just look for a red shy guy like me, but not quite as handsome. Hit. That's funny. Graffiti underground. Okay. So that's where we're trying to go. So I think we need to get to this shy guy here. How, are, how exactly are we going to do this? Considering that we have to... We have to get over this bush somehow. Man, these loading screens are just... They are something else, aren't they? I don't like how high this is. How are we gonna... Oh my goodness, I did not expect to see that. Grab some of this confetti here real quick. Get this guy cornered. Is there anything in here? Festival's almost here. I'm so excited. I'm writing notes to myself. <laughs> oh my goodness. K, 
Okay. Well, I guess I can't open that. I got it. There's gotta be something, right? So, like, we need a hook to get into the sewer. But I need to go and get the shy guy. And I'm not exactly sure at this exact moment how we're going to do this. Because we can't jump this high. Let ask for some help. Okay, that didn't help me. Like, what is there that I'm missing? To go and get, um... Because we obviously know what the Shy Guy is, right? And what the Shy Guy looks like. But the problem is, is I can't jump high enough. Is that the right way to do this? If so, this is kind of crazy, Nintendo. Like... Dude, oh my gosh, I'm gonna struggle getting this jump. I, there's no way this is right. There's legitimately no way this is right. This is right, I swear. This is a little hard for a Nintendo to, for it to be right. But no, yeah, it's not right. I'm so confused. Question mark block over here. Okay, whatever this is, is it's not very clear to me what I'm supposed to be doing, which I'm not a fan of that. Because I have to, I'm pretty sure I have to go in here, right? Okay, why didn't I use that hint earlier? Oh my goodness, I'm so dumb. My goodness, that was so stupid. If anyone could defeat the world's largest and most disgusting Goomba, I knew it'd be you, Mario. Hold on. You're... 
you're red just like that other shy guy, nearly as handsome. So you do have to think we need to open the sewer lid. I don't know what you're talking about, but that hook isn't here. Check out the red brick building at the port. That's where I left it. Oh, thank you. Should we go check it out, Mario? Yes, we should right now. Not gonna lie. I understand, like... I, I wish that would have been as quick and clear as, like... But, like... Honestly, I guess... I should be thinking about that, too. Like, so... That was just me being, like, pretty, pretty dumb, so... Okay, we're looking for a red brick building near the port. So this one here, I would assume. Open. There's something in here. There's a spike. Oh, phew, I thought you m might be one of those hideous folded guys or something. You think something's in here? Could be. Seemed like those Foley guys were messing around with in here forever. Well, the hammer of yours sure can shake things up. Did those boxes just move? And yeah, we're gonna get this one to fall. A thousand fold arms? Then we're gonna grab oh. and pull. Go in here. I think we're gonna get these into a wave battle. Let's go. Okay, uh... Right. Perfect. I had to think about that for a minute. We'll, we'll do the boots here. Easy. Perfect. These battles have been really easy so far. Like, really easy so far. Always can collect some confetti. What am I doing in here? Manhole hook is in the store storehouse somewhere, but where? I'm guessing it's in the I it, it's in the box up there. But how am I getting up here? It's not with the confetti, that's for sure. I mean...
This box is moving. Why is this box not moving now? Okay. Okay, but like... Oh, can we push this? Yeah, okay. Good thought there, Travis. Took a minute. Maybe here? There we go. Oh my goodness. A hook for accessing graffiti underground in Toad Town. Oh my goodness, we found it. And it only took a hot minute. get ourselves over to the graffiti underground. And if there's a bench along the way, we may use it to restore some health. We'll use this. And then we will go down. Get yourself a save point. This is the graffiti underground. Ugh, it's so dark in here. Why does everyone seem to like this place so much? Can you turn on the lights, Mario? Otherwise, it'll be dark all the way through this place. Look, someone's here. Who's there? Yes, I'm saved. Omar, I had to run down here and hide from those horrible folded soldiers. Pardon me, I should introduce myself. I'm the curator of Musée Campagnon in Toad Town. I pronounced that wrong. It's a museum with a splendid collection of objects, music, treasures, origami, other wondrous items. And we have even managed to acquire the legendary Supermarino Sea Vessel, believe it or not. We were there. I do hope you'll come visit soon. We're open even with all the organ organized crime we've seen of late. That's actually a good pun. You say Marino? I'm re I'm trying to remember those wor these those words that said that Toad's face just kept getting closer. It was all I could focus on, but maybe the words were more important. Should we go back to town and check out the Musée, whatever that is? What is down here? It looks like we got ourselves a, uh... Okay, we're gonna change. I'm gonna start with the boots here. Yep. And of course, we'll do the boots again. some more bats here. Perfect. 
gotta focus on these because, like, for some reason I just got I gotta make sure like we get it right. Let's go. Timing is just a little off with those. I'd whistle if I knew how. That's funny. Get our health to go up a little bit. More battles. I'm all about the battles this episode, you know? We could do that. Perfect. Bam! We'll use the hammer again. Easy. We'll grab ourselves a mushroom, that's pretty cool. It looks like we got bats and mice now. Perfect. We'll use the boots to get rid of these bats. And then I want the hammer for these mice here. I will say the music of the uh, battle is pretty like... It's pretty good. It's pretty good. So we'll do this one, move there. Do this one, move here. That nine is kind of pathetic. Pretty easy so far. Continuing through this. a lot of bats. Hey, there's a pipe over there. I wonder where it leads. I bet you can hardly contain yourself when you see a pipe that inviting, huh? Oh no, it's all flooded. We can't get across with all that water there. We get soggy. So we gotta clear the water. Bunch of mice right there. Well, let's take them on. Okay, so we're gonna wanna do this, I believe. Then change to this, bring these up. Start the boots. B. 
boots again. And then I want the hammer. Perfect. We make those look easy around here. A spot for the thousand fold arms. And we're going to turn this. That drained the other side. Oh, the water disappeared. Let's also collect some coins while we're here and see what's inside this treasure chest. Why not? We got the manhole cover, collectible treasure. Take a look what's down here and we're gonna get a save. Back here in Toad Town. Hey, we made it to the entrance of Peach's Castle. That sewer really is pretty neat. I mean, I suppose we shouldn't celebrate just yet. We need to see if your poor brother's green hat is okay. And your brother too, of course, yes. And we will head this way. Hmm, what's all that? All the, that pile of junk come flying out of the castle when my brother took it? How dangerous. All right. I think we're getting pretty close to what would be the end of the episode. I'm gonna take a look at and pause here for a minute. Okay, so definitely looks like um, we're not quite to the next area yet. So we're gonna keep going for a little bit. So I'm assuming we need to get this junk out of here. Looks pretty heavy. I don't think we'll be able to move it ourselves. Get into this next area. Not what I wanted to do there. Yeah, I'm just trying to see when it considers us out of Toad Town, which is really interesting. Because we're definitely at Peach's Castle now. There's the hat. Your brother's hat. Hmm, someone wrote Luigi on the inside in very small letters. Is that something Luigi would do? Where could he be, Mario? Help me. Oh. It's almost like that hat just spoke to me in Luigi's voice asking me for help. I'm all folded up somewhere. Maybe in between dimensions. Someone help. There it is again. It almost sounds like he's in between dimensions like I was. But how could that be? Um. Oh, poor Luigi. I'm sure he's met with a really bad fate thanks to my brother. Mario, can I keep this hat as a memory? I didn't know Luigi, but I miss him anyway. It's too bad it has to be this way, but we can't let it get us down. We will hold and treasure your hat forever, Luigi. So we're looking for Luigi. Don't forget about me. Are you walking away, Mario? Okay, so he's somewhere around here. Aha! 
That's breakable. So is this. Are you walking away? I'm trying to figure out where you are. That's gonna give us a thousand fold arms again. I'm so close, bro. Where's it gonna tell me to grab? I can't find. See the find. So that's as far left as I can go. That's as far right. Aha! We had to move around quite a bit there. And there's Luigi. When I saved, I feel weird. Phew, that's some more like it. I'm so glad you're okay, Luigi. Not that we had any doubt. My name's Olivia, by the way. I owe Mario big time for all of his help. By the way, as someone who's been there, I'm wondering how you ended up trapped between dimensions. Let's see, a shy guy put me there, but not a regular shy guy. It was thick and edgy. Before I knew it, it had folded me up and tucked me away in there. It said it'd come back for me later. How awful for you, but at least you didn't tur get turned into a folded soldier. Oh, but I do have good news. Your hat survived without you. My hat? But what happened to the whole castle? And where's Princess Peach? Oh, I thought you'd be happier to see the hat. Well, my brother kidnapped Peach in her castle. We're on our way to stop him right now, but it's a long way and there are streamers blocking us. Oh, that's right. I was going to go look for the key to Peach's castle. We got locked in, remember? Mario's always saving me, so I just wanted to do something nice for him for a change. I'm really happy to see my hat again, but I still gotta find that key. Let's a go. Well, we definitely might need the key if we make it to the castle, so let's pin our all our hopes on Luigi. Good luck, Luigi. See you later. I do need a hat. <laughs> well, now that we know he's okay, what should we do next? I mean, we're still heading up to Peach's castle, but... Should we look around here for the clues first? Well, we can look for some clues, why not? Might be helpful. We still have to figure out how to, um... Get to this other side here. I hear something moving. It's like that car that was blocking the way earlier. Didn't we have a car that was like over here blocking something? What if we go back for a minute? Oh, someone moved that pile of junk was there. It's probably Luigi, wasn't it? I wish my brother were as kind and thoughtful as yours. Open. Go ahead and hit the save point right here. Head up. Oh, I think we found the castle. It's right there. But I don't know how we're going to make it past those streamers. They're weirdly strong for paper. Plus, it looks like they're coming from different places. Will we have to go all over the world to unravel them? So if the red streamer is going in this direction, it seems like following it will lead us to where we need to go, doesn't it? Probably. So let's go ahead and follow it. Head down. Somebody help me. 
I'm in between dimensions. Hey, it sounds like somebody nearby is in the same kind of jam I was in earlier. Should we help them? In case it wasn't clear, I don't like it in here. Help. Isn't that a voice calling for help? Are we going to ignore it? Well, we're going to take on this battle real quick. Okay, we should have two moves, right? Yep. So we're going to do this. Okay, I'm going to do this, move it back, and then switch. No, that's not what I did. Oh, dude, I want to move that. That really sucks. That didn't do exactly what I wanted it to do, so the enemy is gonna have a. That really sucks. Like, I think I clicked A a little too quickly, so that's kind of silly for my liking. Unfortunate. Do this. And we got ourselves a toad. A few, thank you so much. Now I can get back to my shop in Toad Town. I hate to be away for more than a few minutes, you see. It's a big problem when I'm working on my control issues, but we have weapons, items, and all sorts of useful things. Stop by. Oh man, the bridge didn't used to be bro all broken like this. How am I supposed to get back to my shop? We got all the toads rescued from Toad Town. I'm just gonna leave him here? It seems like he really needs to get back to his shop. Well... Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, you fixed it, thank you. I'm literally going to sprint over to my shop right now, but first, here's a free sample of my wares, enjoy. Got ourselves a mushroom. I'm off, gotta put out the fire that I assume is burning down my shop because I wasn't there. I wanted to kind of like, I don't know, ignore the toad because trying to complete this thing here. Looks like we're saving. <laughs> I probably shouldn't have ignored the toad though. But we have moved into Picnic Road, so that is going to end this episode. Thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like on it. It helps me out tremendously. Also, comment and subscribe so you don't miss any, miss out on any future content of this series. Thank you again all so much for watching. And until next time, I will see you all later.